turn off my phone? Yeah. Earth to Matilda. This phone is as much a part of me as... Uh, Earth to Derek. That phone is so 2001. There's a lot of buzz surrounding the upcoming iPhone 6S and the 6S Plus, with experts looking for a faster processor, more RAM, and better cameras. In the meantime, though, let's look at other phones from the near future. First up, Google's Project Aura. Aura is a modular cell phone, which means it's easy to upgrade old hardware and lets you create a phone tailored to your specific needs. Photographers, choose a better camera. Audio files, upgrade your speakers. And the clumsy oh, can swap out their broken screen. Aura is being tested in Puerto Rico. We should see it in about a year with the base that you plug all the attachments into for around $50 to $100. The attachments themselves, of course, will vary in price. Next, another smartphone by Google, the Nexus 360. Flexible, you can bend it into a wristband. Remind you of anything? I'm in town. Make sure Uncle Gadget gets here safely. The camera also rotates, so it'll always face in the right direction. Oh, and bonus, a built-in Bluetooth headset. Should be on shelves in the next three to four years. And the last future phone on our list won't be handheld or wrap around your wrist. It's going to be integrated directly into your brain. It's something called cybernetics. Futurists predict the humans of tomorrow will outfit their bodies with electronics. You've seen it in movies like The Matrix. With cybernetics, we'll be able to upload info directly to our brains, swap body parts like eyes for superhuman vision, and even integrate communication devices like phones to interact with the world and web around us. Cool communicators on 